every week, new creative ideas, new tutorial is posted on my YouTube channel. You can also find me on Facebook and Instagram at Yarn Basket by MCN where I post my weekly crochet projects, tutorials, and you can even obey my crochet projects at affordable prices. So what are you waiting for? Smash the subscribe button and let's get started. You will need your crochet project, foam, yarn, a 0.6 millimeter crochet hook, a 3 millimeter crochet hook, some safety pins, a darning needle, pencil, and a pair of scissors. Let's begin with the outline. Grab your foam and your pencil. Let's start creating an outline around the foam, preferably 0.5 to 1 cm from the edge of the foam. And we're done. Now grab your 0.6 millimeter crochet hook and poke holes with your hook along the outline. Like so. Continue doing so all the way around the foam. The space between the holes is approximately 0.6 cm. This is how it looked like. Now for the edging, let's begin by creating a slip knot. Then grab your foam and 3mm crochet hook. This time, we're going to create an edging around the foam and I'll be starting at the middle. You may start anywhere you want but I'll be starting right here. Insert your hook into the hole and into the loop. Then pull through. After which, single crochet and chain 1. So that will be our pattern. Insert your hook into the hole, pull through. Single crochet. And chain 1. Again, insert your hook into the hole, pull through, single crochet, and chain 1. Repeat this pattern all the way through, and I will be back once I'm right at the end.
blast one single crochet and chain one then insert your hook into the very first chain like so so this is how the edging look like now cut your working yarn Let's secure it by chaining two to one and two. Pull up your yarn and pull it nice and tight. And we're done with the edging. Before we go on, let's tie these two together. Okay? After which, weave in these two later on. Let's now move on into the last step which is sewing the foam into the crochet project. Make sure to attach the foam while wearing your project to make sure it is placed well. Then secure it first with safety pins as you can see. When sewing the foam into the project, make sure not to flatten the foam. Otherwise, maintain its concave shape. So let's now proceed. I'll be starting at the middle to the left. Let's begin. Grab your darning needle and your working yarn. And let's start sewing by inserting your needle into the two loops right here and into your project right here then pull through again insert your hook into the two loops right here and into your project then pull through repeat these steps until you're done sewing your foam into your project and i'll be back once i'm right at the end We are almost done now. And we're done. Let's now tie these two yarns together. But before that, cut your working yarn. And create three knots one two and three make sure you pull it nice and tight and remove the safety pins don't forget to weave in the excess yarns and you're done with your project i hope you enjoyed this tutorial and see you next time bye